day after day after day <laughs> when I turn them in. <laughs> so wait, what is it? It's just been one big diddle, huh? Yes. But what was your word to say in it? It, it was poop butt. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> wow. So we have a saying in our house. Um, I, we say it here and my parents say it. And somehow <laughs> Christian kind of started it what, like six or eight months ago? He called something a diddle. No, I remember. So Grandma said um, Grandpa always diddles around when he's supposed to do something. So then I said, well, that's just a little diddle. Oh, that's true. Um, so my dad is notorious for when everybody's ready to go. Um, he comes up with something to do before we leave, and so we're always waiting on him. <laughs> And so my mom uh, said, you know, whenever it's time to go, Grandpa's just diddling around. And so Christian said, well, that's just one big diddle. So now anytime something is frustrating or annoying, we all say, that's just one big diddle. So, what a diddle. Yeah, what a diddle. So that's kind of kind of our funny yeah. thing between all of us. But this say, week, I don't know, this week has been a little bit... Um, more challenging, huh? Would and you say the same thing? I'm finished. Yeah. And if we all You wouldn't say the same thing? No, but I would. But yeah. You would. But if we also get frustrated, we always say, um, or if we get frustrated at someone else, we would say, I just wanna squeeze you. Uh-huh. I just wanna squeeze you. <laughs> Alright, so Christian, you're all done. Yeah. I think you might wanna maybe go put like some sweatpants and a sweatshirt on. <laughs> well, I guess one thing about it, friends, is it saves on laundry. So, find the positive. Okay, so today is just a little bit more chill than yesterday. Um, as you could see this morning, Christian got done with his stuff pretty quickly. Uh, Chloe didn't have quite as much either, so we're just going to kind of take it a little bit easier today. Um, they wanna watch a movie this afternoon, and then tonight, Sam and I are doing dinner with some friends of ours on Zoom. So the parents will be at a table, and then the kids will be in another room um, at their table, and then we can all just kinda of talk amongst ourselves. So I think that will go good. So I wanna get all of my work done prior to the movie, because I wanna be able to sit down after dinner and hang out with either the kids or Sam or whatever. Um, maybe watch a TV show. What are you guys watching? Um, tell me in the comments below what you have been watching. I would love to know. We are not really TV people because we never have time because we're always doing like homework or Sam has um, meetings at night. Um, so we never get the opportunity, but I would love to check out some of the things that you guys are watching if you wanna share them down below and share for everybody else because um, everybody can see your comments. Sorry, my hand's getting tired. Um, everybody can see your comments and can go and check out the shows that you're watching also. I got a lot of really good feedback yesterday from the Power Hour, so I thought I would do that again today and just knock out the things that I want to get knocked out before tonight and then just kind of show you what we're doing here because really that's all that I'm going to be doing um, is these little tasks and then obviously making supper, but we're going to do the movie and Christian has a guitar lesson and drums and all that kind of stuff. So. Um, really quick, let's get things knocked out. I'll show you what is on my list. On the list for today, I want to dust the main. Um, that means my kitchen area, living room, dining room, uh, my office, the master bedroom, and then the bathrooms. So I'm going to dust those areas because I, I had the back, um, the back door open yesterday going out to our sunroom and so much dirt and stuff came in because it was so uh, windy that it just it got dust everywhere so I want to get that done I want to vacuum the main rugs so that would be um, the living room the master and the office uh, and then I want to vacuum the stairs so I have stairs going downstairs uh, to the basement and then stairs going upstairs to the loft where Christian and Chloe's bedroom is so that is what I want to tackle today and we are going to try and tackle that in an hour 
Um, I'll set a timer for each task. That way you can kind of see how long each of these different things takes. Um, it's, it's fun to see if people can get it done in an hour, but then it's also fun to see like how long does it actually take to dust the main living space? How long does it take to vacuum stairs? Because I think a lot of times we convince ourselves that we can't do something because it's going to take a longer period of time than it does. And then when we realize, oh, well, that's only five minutes, um, then we can start to get a lot more done because we don't psych ourselves out to begin with. So, all right, let's tackle this. Um, I'm actually going to go in this order. So um, let's start dusting. wrap up this vlog so that I can get it edited, um, watch the movie, make supper, have our date night, um, and then just chill. So 
So I hope that you guys have had an amazing Thursday. Tomorrow is Friday, it is Good Friday. Um, and so that is awesome. This weekend is Easter. I'm super excited that um, no matter what's going on in our world, we are still constantly reminded that um, Jesus is in charge and he paid for every single thing that's happening right now. So that is always amazing to me. But I hope you guys have a good rest of your evening. Um, if you're liking these videos, if you're liking the vlog, if you are you know, wanting more power hours in the vlogs, let me know in the comments below or give me a thumbs up. That way I bring to you what you wanna see and I don't waste your time or my time. Um, click on that red subscribe button down below and um, if you wanna be notified every time I post something new, click on that bell. It will let you know on your computer or your phone. All right, friends, just like always, until tomorrow, I just encourage you to intentionally create a life that you want to live. Guard your time wisely and sprinkle confetti wherever you go. I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.